Last time, <clears throat> Alex and I got into the Mac. A big old fight. I'm okay. Fuck. <sighs> I'm okay. <sighs> She's a little fucked up about I'm it. I'm okay. I guess I might as well unpack. Okay, so I have a new text message. Hey Alex, this is Ryan. Oh yeah, it's the fucking heterosexual at the record store. Don't care, heterosexual. About my block. I'm gonna choose to believe this isn't about me. I actually already read this at the end of the last stream, but uh, I'm gonna read it again anyway. The Black Lantern will be providing beers. Python mining. Okay, so what am I supposed to do next? Uh, unpack bag. Also check out the room. Got some metal. What an honor to be the sister of the Rubber Duck Derby second place finisher. <laughs> Truly impressive. Cycling metal. Got a nice little sculpture. Charlotte made this? Gabe mentioned she was an artist, but I didn't realize he meant, like, professionally. I could never make something so personal. Is that a sword? Yeah, it's for, for LARPing, obviously. The song. The real travesty. Huh. You've really changed the art style since I read these. Must be Ethan's. Wonder how many times Gabe's been forced to play. Dinoracer 2. Holy shit. It looks like Gabe actually read this. Aww. Chapter 4 is the most important. Let's discuss it over wine. I love you. See? Enjoy Peak 19 beer. What's on the map? Broadcasting straight from your local record store. Because how fucking cool is that? At least I it held it together cool. in front of Ryan and Steph. Whoa. Looks like Ryan turned my brother into Aww. a model citizen. Kind of gay. It's not really, but you know, I can pretend. I'm really happy for you, Gabe. Aww. Okay, so you can do this to the objects. object. Great. Right. 
Alex. Do I want to know? That's me. That, that's me. I'm Alex. Guess I kind of gave Gabe the runaround, huh? Anita and Eduardo. <laughs> they were one of the good ones. Wow. Gabe's been looking for me for a while. Not her. <laughs> nope. Oh, it's gay. I love it. I gotta go for the gay outfit. Hell yeah. Bootleg. No way. Gabe has this photo too? Look at our parents. Mom's healthy. Dad's only kind of an asshole. Alright. I know I kicked the drywall crack when I see one. Greetings from Mexico. Looks like we've both had people trying to help us. I'm glad it made a difference for Gabe. Gabe looks like he fits right in. Oh man, Gabe used to crush me, jerk. All right, oh, there's a bike. Got Gabe to always wanted a bike like this. So that's everything except for the drawer. Right. Guess I kind of gave Gabe the runaround. Yeah, so huh? you look at the letter, and then the bag will progress the plot. I can look at it normally. So Gabe and Riley have been working on her interview and Mac thought they were sleeping together. This is fucking stupid. Yeah, the straights be like that though. They really do be like that. Bri, I'm telling you, his story doesn't add up. He wants you. He's helping me get into college, baby. You know dudes can do nice things without the expectation of getting laid, right? A high school dropout? A guy who went to a fucking juvie? Wants to be your study buddy? What, out of the goodness of his heart? Oh my god, Mac, we're friends. There is nothing going on between Gabe and me. Yep, sounds about right. Okay, I guess um, that's everything in here. So let's see. I guess no one needs to do this. <clears throat> Crack memory. Uh, okay. Yep. But it looks like Mr. John Chen left San Miguel County about six months after his arrival. Yeah, is, is there like a forwarding address on file? I'm sorry, sir. That's not information we retain. Thanks again for calling the San Miguel County Clerk's Office. Have a pleasant afternoon. No, 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 no! Hey, don't!
Okay. Let's open the bag. Unpack shoe shoe. Oh god. Shoe shoe's gonna look so grungy on this nice bed. She's gotten me through some hard times, but I was hoping we were done with that. Ethan's really talented. Makes sense that his mom's an artist. I never heard back from Sydney. I hope she's okay. At least she cared. More than I can say for most. I really wish those mitts had worked. Aww. Chelsea, the rare bright spot from my time in the group home. So Chelsea, Sydney, that's August. Do you have any text messages from those people? Yeah, we have Chelsea. Chelsea's still talking to us.
crazy how much we've changed. Hey, it's the same photo that he has over there. It's really nice that Gabe and I both held on to this photo. What's going on with the Shu Shu? We've seen things, haven't we, Shu Shu? Yeah, sure have. My journal. Time to add my latest meltdown. Ugh. I'll finish this later. Oh, uh, hell yeah. Time for some guitar. Aww. No fucking way. Ah. <sighs> Am I gonna cry? Maybe. Well, Alex? You just went nuts and beat the shit out of somebody in front of your brother. So, how are you feeling right now? I had a choice. What music to play? When you were here before, couldn't look you in the eye. You dress like an angel. Skin makes me cry. You float like a feather in a beautiful world. I wish I was special. You're so very special, but I'm a creep. Makes you happy. Whatever you want, you're so very special. God, I wish I was special, but I'm a creep. I'm a weirdo. What the hell am I doing here? I don't belong here. I don't belong Aww, here. Aw, Alex. You too belong. 
<sighs> you and your damn surprises, Gabe. Being here is too good to be true. I'm yep, not gonna let anything mess up. Nothing bad gonna happen. Everything is gonna be happy now. It's all gonna be fine. I should go downstairs and set things right. I don't right know how they're gonna get five whole chapters out of this. You know, I mean, there's some issues that are being worked on. There's some friction between Alex and Mac, and you know, she's really into death. Like, other than that. Okay. How did he get this up here? Can I actually play this? Wow. God damn it. by a, a minecart. That's really unfortunate. Mm -hmm. I could also die of fall damage. Good enough for me. Gabe, Nathan. That's probably Steph. Steph has played a little bit. D U K? D U K is.
We'll never know. Brian, just forget it. Stop that. You need to take care of yourself. Got Mac patched up. Let's take a look at you now. Oh, looks pretty nasty right about here. <laughs> so, it hurts when you breathe? Alex, you made it. Charlotte, right? I'm sorry you had to see that fight. What a terrible first impression. Dad, I'm taking Gabe to the station. We need a first aid kit that doesn't predate the discovery of bacteria. It's fine. I don't need to go. Well, Ryan knows what he's doing. Now you just go with him. It's a pretty old. Alex, uh, first I'll aid be back guy. soon. Okay. Okay. Well, there goes my bartender and my backup bartender. I love that. It's a falling star? Yeah. Or rising. Depends on the day, I guess. So, what's it doing today? Rising, for sure. First day of my new life. Oh, good. I'm glad Max's stupidity didn't ruin everything. Nothing I haven't seen before. I heard Ethan gave you an issue of his comic. He obviously thinks you're really cool. But does he think I'm cooler than Gabe? I'd say you have a shot. Gabe plays dirty though. Like he secretly teaches Ethan to swear. By the way, thanks for telling us about the mine. Ethan's not allowed up there anymore. Yeah, no problem. I hope you won't be mad at me. You did the right thing. Beef pie special. Watch the gravy. Gross. Jed, you didn't have to. Now, Ryan said you're skipping dinner. No starving artists on my watch. I do have to get going. I'm making some pieces for the spring festival, and they have to be done tonight. Sorry I couldn't talk longer. Oh, that's okay. I'm so glad you're here, Alex. I'm looking forward to getting to know you. Yeah, same. Bye. Thanks for supper. Yep. Oh, hell yeah, my girlfriend. So I'm short-staffed at the moment. Gabe tells me you've worked at a restaurant before. A couple years' experience as a server? Uh... Maybe not as long as that, but yeah. I've done lots of things. You want to work a shift? See if you might like it here? Sure. All right. So, we have a few folks that need checking on. Ducky and Diane over there. Steph over here. Uh, there's a table in the back that needs clearing also. You can give the food orders to me, and I'll handle anyone here at the bar. All right? Got it. It's really nice to have you here, Alex. Thanks. Guess I'm a server now. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. My dad was in the service. I should check on that table. Damn boys, always fighting. Time to grow up. Should have seen Gabe go at it with dad. He's come a long way. Behind that mountain man beard. Venison and leek pie. I need to try that. 
that does sound like five. Denver omelet, Rocky Mountain oysters, jalapeno poppers, broccoli soup. Can I get you two anything? Miss Chan, here at last to relieve our suspense. Hi. I am Reginald McAllister, the third, ducky to friends, former entrepreneur, now retired, and this young woman is Diane. Hey there. Nice to meet you. I didn't realize that... Uh, that we Ducky and Diane. <laughs> we all knew you were coming. Yes, Gabe is generous with uh, both friendship and information. You're from Portland, right? I moved here from DC six months ago. How are you finding the small town thing? I've been here one day and I've already hit my hug quota for the year. <laughs> She's funny. Diane is a geologist recently working as a process manager for Typhon Mining. I'm glad That's there's another the newbie around here, too. Can I get you anything? Oh, yeah, we're super hungry. I'd love a pie special with fries. Cheeseburger with mushrooms, and my usual to drink. Jed will know what to do. All right, I'll go put that order in. Thanks. My dad was in the service. He did? Yeah. I've got an order from Ducky and Diane. Go ahead. Cheeseburger with mushrooms. One cheeseburger with mushrooms. And pie special with fries. Uh huh. And? One pie special with fries. Ducky asked for his usual? Yeah, he did. Yeah, he's fond of a particular rye whiskey. I keep a personal bottle for him. Oh, that's odd. I don't see it. Oh, now wait. I bet Ducky took that bottle upstairs last night. Yeah, he and Gabe went on carousing long after closing. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Serves him right if you ask me. But feel free to go upstairs and look for it. I'm sure he'd be grateful. Oh, if you can't find it, Deputy Pike was with him. Might have some idea. He's usually in here around now. Probably arriving soon. There must be something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. That's Charlotte's dispensary. She seems cool. If you're not 21 yet, this post isn't for you. Ryan seems oh. like a sweet guy. Okay. Still want to hit the trail. Oh, hey. Someone made a course about my life. Finding gratitude in the midst of chaos. Oh shit. Now Mac's scared. Aww. At least he's not freaking out anymore. He won't make me lose control. Steph was in here. Let's see. Haven seems pretty serious about this festival. Coupons for weed? 
What a time to be alive. Hell yeah. How mysterious. husband seems fake wow i messed mac up pretty good idiot you're gonna lose her you're gonna lose her and it's all your fault at it least he's actually. right about something yeah can i also play this game wow that's that's cool play a bunch of the good old top score Ass. Class. That looks interesting. Yeesh. Glad I'm not a 19th century miner. Nineteen lives? Jed is a real hero. Business card memory. Unusually personable staff. Nicely done, big bro. Is there anything this woman can't do? Where's my girlfriend? Last Guess weekend. these were for mining. Is that just a hole? Damn. I wonder if the bullet's still in there. Not a bad company once you get used to how they operate. Right. Starting over from yeah, scratch like this? Telling me. Fucking terrifying is what it is. You're telling me. Huh? Oh, is that really Ryan? Oh. Yeah, I guess. The way they do. My extensive wilderness map reading knowledge tells me that there is a whole lot of wilderness around here. It's just so... I don't know. Only 45 bucks for the chance to get mauled by a bear. Thanks for driving me home, my friend. You're the nicest <laughs> Whoa! Hey! Great. Another wipeout. Hunt is a funny name. <laughs> like the fish. Officer Fish. <laughs> Jason, Pike is my. S Holy shit, is it snowing? Yep. Sure is. Man, poor Pike. Sweet jukebox. I'll have to check out the song sometime. That looks radioactive. She's playing out the LARP, right? That's the girl from the record store. Steph. Alex, right? I'm Steph. 
Hey. Just seeing if you need food or anything. Oh no, I'm good. Thanks though. Sorry I couldn't hang out at the record store. Uh, yeah. Got some time, time now though you. if you want to chat. Do it. Is that record store inventory? <laughs> no, it's character stats. Do you know what a LARP is? Sure. Live action role play, right? Fantasy fighting in real life? Yep. Gabe was talking about a LARP with Ethan. Yeah, it's next week. They're coming with me. It's their first time. I'm so excited. <laughs> Would you ever want to join us sometime? Sure, I'd try it. If you and Gabe both like it, it must be super fun. Give me the awesome. action will have consequences. So are you um, here with somebody or? That's Ryan's stuff. Apparently he ditched me for Gabe. They went to get first aid. Being a hero again. Ryan's always doing that. <laughs> it's a Luke and family thing. Have you heard about Jed's rescue? I saw some stuff on the walls. People here still talk about it. The tourism board wanted to I make a movie. I can't imagine. Alex wants an earload of Haven trivia just now. Sorry, Jed. He's so modest, it's ridiculous. Is that your shot? What is that? This is bedazzled kiwi schnapps. No one's ever ordered it, so Gabe's trying to get rid of it with the jukebox game. What's a jukebox game? It's like a short version of 20 questions where you're trying to guess a song, guess wrong, you have to take the shot. <laughs> Ryan and I are going to play. You wanna take his place? Dude, you're on. <laughs> yes. So. I'll pick a song. You have five yes or no questions before you have to guess it. Okay. That's spicy. Got one. Jukebox is all yours. So? What do you want to ask me? Hmm. I should flip through these and see what might be good to ask. on the cover no yeah no only one word it is more than one word hmm does the song have a long title like four words or more Yes. Interesting. You've got two questions left. What? No 
would say I don't go all out for my girl. I got my notepad out. I'm doing this the old fashioned way. So we know person. No. Those are people. Maybe not. So. One, two,
that. Punctuation is in the song name. No. Is there an animal on the cover art? Uh, no, no animals. Ugh, too bad. Some of these are really cute. I know, right? Last question. Yeah, all right, I know. So, five is out. It's not ideal. Is the band name on the cover? Yep, that's your five. Ready to guess? Yeah, let me look through one last time. Here's what I know. It's not a one word band name. <laughs> Fuck. Yes, nice one. I got her. <clears throat> guess I'm drinking? work okay there must be something around the black lantern that can help me if i think i see a lot more of the jukebox game in my future gabe's got pretty cool friends hey Anyone? I hope yeah, Ryan's yeah. got better supplies. Damn boys, always fighting. Time to grow up. See if I can find Ducky's whiskey up here. Hmm. 
Maybe Ducky left his whiskey up there? Ducky's whiskey could be one of the... This all looks really fancy, but no rye whiskey. I'm guessing the whole Officer Piker thing is like an actual required piece of information to find out. Like, you can't even. Maybe? That's gonna be my guess. If going upstairs will trigger the event that makes Officer Piker come in. That's what I'm hoping. There must be something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. Glad you could fill in today. Ducky, Jed thinks you took your whiskey up to Gabe's yesterday. Do you know where you might have left it? I remember absolutely nothing of the night. <laughs> really? Maybe check your phone. Did you take any pictures? Call anyone? Have a look. <laughs> Don't just give people your phone, dude. Fucking weird-ass boomer. For goodness sake. How nice. Poor Ducky. I shouldn't be reading this. Aww. Sorry, nothing useful. Well, thanks for letting me know. My dad was in the service. Glad you could fill in today. Jed asked me to clear that off. Yeah, but see, if you do that, that will progress the plot. Hey. over from scratch like this fucking terrifying is what it is it is Chad. my dad was in the service haven is nice just wish it felt like home hope we both get there soon this one's from yesterday hold up it was colonel ducky on gabe's couch with the bottle 
on the couch. Found this upstairs in Gabe's couch. What a relief! Many thanks, Alex. My pleasure, Ducky. Can I pour you a glass? Uh, no, no. Allow me. Oh, yeah. Miss Alex Chen, a most tenacious detective. To Alex. Cheers. Her dad was in the service. You, you hear that? I haven't heard it. She's only said it like 10 times. Hey, Mac. Holy shit. Can I talk to you real quick? What do you want? Listen, what happened upstairs was fucked up, right? From both of us. Where are you going with this? Look, Riley's headed over here. She's pretty heated. I, I don't think it helps to recap all the gory details, you know? <laughs> yeah. Fuck this dude. You really are a piece of shit. Look, she's gonna break up with me otherwise. I'm, I'm sorry. You're not convinced. We've been together four this years. This guy sucks. I, I know it's gonna she's be the, the thing. the best thing that's ever happened to me. Where there's other stuff going on, but I don't fucking care. Please, this guy really help me out. No. I, I don't know, man. Shit. What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh my god. Look at your face. No, it's okay. Don't even. What were you thinking? Where's Gabe? Why do you give a shit? Because on, my dude. boyfriend just got into a fight with him. I swear. This is it. You better have a good explanation or we're done. It's not my fault. I just wanted to talk to the guy. About what? About you! About why you guys are meeting behind my back. Okay. So how did the fight happen? The bastard sucker punched me. Okay, um... <laughs> Not exactly sucker punched, but he definitely started it. Oh, God. Were you there, too? Ugh. Look, I fucking can't. I cannot with the heterosexuals. Yeah, I was there. Max telling you a whole lot of bullshit. You know what? That doesn't even surprise me anymore. So what really happened? Riley. Mac barged in, accused Gabe of sleeping with you, sucker punched him, and then kicked him while he was down. Riley, listen. 
What happened to Mac's face? <laughs> I happened. I did that. Well, good. It sounds like he deserved it. Thanks for telling me the truth, Alex. Wait. Wait, are you... are we okay? Are you fucking serious? I'm so embarrassed by you right now. But are we still together? Come on, what do you dude. think, uh. you fucking idiot? No. Alex Chen? Hey, it's Pike. Uh... Assaulting Mac Loudon on your first day here, huh? I'm Jason Pike, the deputy sheriff. Oh, fuck off, dude. I'm gonna take you in for questioning. Are you saying I'm under arrest? No, you're detained. <laughs> your face. <laughs> this is fucked up. See your face. Back. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, I'm only kidding. Uh, nobody's in trouble here. That's a funny right? prank, dude. You're an actual cop. Gabe and I just like to prank each other. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I've never been pranked by a cop before. <laughs> you definitely got me. <laughs> Thanks so for being funny. a good sport. Can I buy you a drink? Um, maybe. I'm working right now. Well, I'll be at the bar. You want one, you just come by, okay? Stuff timer. Hey. Nope. She's still in the hay zone. Good. All right, what you got for me, Pike? Damn, was that drank out of wine? Yes, it was Did out I come of out wine. Too it was, was bold. I'll give you that. I'll talk to you. Though. Hey, Alex. I'm ready to take you up on that drink. All right. Wait, hey, Jed, can we get, uh... Thanks. And keep it quick. She's on the clock. <laughs> <sighs> you know, your brother's been talking about you getting here for months. I'm starting to get the sense. I even remember exactly the day he found your number. He was telling everybody in this place. Really? Yeah. World's okay as boyfriend. Uh, pretty heartwarming stuff. Well, I've got to get back to work. Later, Alex. Playing darts. Okay. We shall progress the plot again. Are you finished up with everything you want to do? Yeah, I took care of everything you mentioned. Is there anything else you'd like me to do? Nah, the boys should be back soon. Hey, look, it's them right now. Well, speak of the devil. It's almost like this is a. How a you feeling? Game. Not great. Not awful. I got Alex covering for you. For real? We need to talk. I'll be on the rooftop, okay? Okay. I think that's enough for today. You did great work. You'll be a damn fine addition to our team. You can't keep an injured man waiting. You better go upstairs. Thanks. We'll see you tomorrow. Okay. Time to talk to Gabe.
Haven has an indie movie theater. Impressive. How's your jaw? Is the pain bad? Look, Gabe, I'm really sorry. I... Did you rehearse that move? No. Only in my mind. <laughs> so, need a manager for your underground cage fighting career? Gabe, I'm really sorry. How many bones have you broken? Like, on other people? Dude, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. Don't apologize. I'm fine. Now that we're talking about it, I guess I never realized. That I can kick your ass? That I can kick your ass? Yeah, I guess. You know, I never realized what your life must have been like. On your own. It was fine. You know, when I pulled you off the Mac and you hit me, I, I was angry. Then I thought about how you took him apart. Like you've done it before. Kids in foster care fight a lot. I learned how to defend myself. I'd say. I can tell there's something going on with you. Something troubling you. Maybe it's time you open up. I want to talk to Gabe, but what can I even say right now to explain what happened with Mac? There's something off about me. I know what other people are feeling. I can see these auras around them. And if they feel strongly enough, if they're angry or sad or afraid, I feel it too. And then I lose control.
And this has happened... ...for a long time. Like Mac. I felt all that anger like it was my own. I think it was pretty clear that Mac was angry. It's more than that. He wasn't just angry at you, he's angry at himself. He thinks he's gonna lose Riley. He is. Did Riley tell you that? No. No one told me that. I just... feel it. Sure, it's not just... you know... It's not just in my head, Gabe. I promise. It's not from meds, or stress, or trauma, or whatever. It's real. Can you tell what I'm feeling right now? It doesn't work like that. It's only when you feel really strong emotions. Oh. I don't expect you to believe me. No one does. So you can actually feel what other people are feeling? Yes. You're like going inside their heart. I guess I am. Dude, you have superpowers. <laughs> Getting beat up and having no friends? That's a super curse, dude. Okay, okay, maybe superpowers is a bit strong. It's just... I have no idea what's going on with people half the time. Charlotte's teaching me how to improve my emotional intelligence, but this, this is on another level. You can get in there, that's... that's really special. Special. It's really your take on all this? Totally. I mean, it's whatever you make it, right? But it doesn't matter what's going on. I'm here for you. Don't forget that. Tell me about the guitar. Oh, shit. You found it. It was supposed to be a huge surprise. It surprise? was. Surprise? <laughs> well, what do you think? I love it. Thank you so much. Of course. Welcome home. Oh, hey, dude. What's up? Hey. Is Ethan up here? No, he was heading home. He was, but I haven't seen him in a while. Did it again. <laughs> Every goddamn time. You don't think. Maybe. Fuck, maybe he did. What is it? I think he went up to the mountains. If he actually did, we need to move. Now. Yeah, let's yeah, we go. Do.
Ethan? Ethan! Come on, pick up, pick up. Alex. This way. since I was up here. You don't do your ranger stuff around here? Private land, outside of my jurisdiction. Dad brought me up here a bunch when I was little, though. I was his miner in training. <laughs> that was back before mining men blowing the tops off mountains. Any luck? We'll touch base with the safety team up at the site. We're gonna postpone tonight's blast until we find them. Oh. At least we're not racing the clock. Hey. You good? Charlotte's gotta be losing it right now. Hey, she's tough. Always has been. Come on, let's take a look around. This kid. Can you imagine the shit we would have caught from Dad if we'd done anything like this? Hey, we're gonna find him. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Hey, thanks again for your help. Could have been a lot worse if you hadn't kept me in the loop. Of course. I'm gonna go take a look around. Let me know if you spot any sign of Ethan. Sure. I can do that. How was Ethan planning to get into the mine? Landed a job on my first day. Maybe this fresh start is still salvageable. Something tells me best match. <laughs> Muscle plus. God, I love her. Oh, she's so good. Murder barn. Tomorrow doesn't need your approval. Yeah. Tell her. My joyride in this will have to wait until after we found Ethan. How is the rubber zombie the least creepy thing out here? Hey, bro. Want to get wasted at the old mine? The real monster here is underage drinking. You don't realize until you're up close, but mining equipment is super murdery. I got you. 
I got you. It's okay. You're okay. Is that everybody? I need a head count. Probably not as fun to ride in as they look. Alex warned me. I could have stopped this. I'm such a fucking fucker. Gabe cares about Ethan so much. We have to find him. Come on, Ryan. Everyone is depending on you. Ryan won't let his fear get in the way. I'm glad he's here. Wow. Once Ethan's safe, I'll raise one too. Imagine being trapped down there. Or actually, yeah. Not... Or actually, what happened here? Massive cave in. Bunch of trapped miners. All nearly died. Jed led the whole team back to the surface. God. Yeah, that's the day Foreman Jed became local hero Jed. And then Typhon closed up this site, basically bought Jed the Black Lantern. Huh. Same logo. Did he? Okay. Okay. If the wall is an illusion... Nothing obvious. Maybe we should... Notice anything? No shit. I'll be damned. The whole story is about Ethan's character breaking into a monster stronghold deep underground. Sounds like the mind of me. Does it show where he went? Not sure. The comic ends with the monster hunter climbing a watchtower, which shows him where to go. There. The silo. I bet that's the tower. That's where he went. You're a genius. Yeah. Great find, Alex. Gabe, you want to take a crack at unlocking that gate? I'm on it. We should also be able to get to it through the processing building. If we can find a way in. Let's take a look, then. Okay. Ethan based his comic on this place. went a different way. Alex warned me I could have stopped this. So Any luck? Been a minute since I tried to break a lock. I've lost my edge. <laughs> What you told me before, if he were out here and, like, feeling something, could you use it to find him? He'd have to be feeling it, like, a lot. Like, really strong. Even then, I don't know. Guess it was worth a shot.
So, did Ethan? Oh, man. I think there's like a side door back there? I don't know. You can guess there might be. Give me a hand. figured that out from a comic book. I'm gonna try to get the lights on. You try to figure out where Ethan went. Did you get your checks? Ethan must have come through here. How did he get out? Anne? You okay? I'm sorry to call you at work. I just came home from the doctor. I couldn't wait for you to come home. Baby doll? I, I'm pregnant, Jed. Have I got some good news for you. <laughs> all the buttons. Also, kind of scared to push any of the buttons. Ugh. Let's hope omens aren't really a thing. Oh, that's the other guy. Ugh. Worse than sleeping on the ground. Nope. Thanar doesn't battle any bed bugs. So much stuff just left behind. This thing has seen better days. I hope Alex is right about this comic thing. We're burning minutes here. I hope so too. I'm not confident this is gonna work. Yeah, it was worth a shot, I guess. Ethan must have passed through some other way. Let me see what I can figure out. If Ethan didn't get out through the door, how did he get out? Climb. Well, 
not. I kind of want to push all the buttons. Also, kind of scared to push any of the buttons. Ethan must have gone upstairs. Pretty sure Ethan climbed these stairs. Not sure. I'm gonna have a look. Maybe it's full of Twinkies. Those never go bad, right? Hi, scary old building. Please don't collapse while we're inside you. Thanks. We passed caution like an hour ago. Okay, I'll stay out. Wasn't in the comic. Not in the comic. Thank God. The silo. We're getting close. Ethan made the jump from here to the conveyor belt? Oof. Think I'll find another way through. Looks like Ethan climbed the conveyor belt out to the silo. Yikes. Yeah. I agree. Maybe there's some way to open the door. wasn't in the comic. You gotta open it. Who knew? Will wonders never cease? Alex is right about this comic thing. We're burning minutes here. What took you so long? You never forget how to break a lock. It's like riding a bike. Where to next, Alex?
Sainor looks out from the watchtower and spots the secret entrance to the stronghold. If we can just... There. That's where he's heading. That's by the ravine. Shit! Let's go! We close? Think so. Ethan! 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 Yeah, nothing bad's gonna happen here. Ethan! Alex! I'm scared! Ethan, I'm coming for you, buddy! Wait. Hold on. Ethan? You okay? Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of here. Just hang on. Fear is so strong. If I get near it... It's no good. We're too heavy. Shit. What about me? Alex. Uh, are you sure? Remember how I taught you how to anchor a belay? Awesome. Show me. You okay? Doesn't really feel like that's relevant right now, to be honest. It's relevant to me. It's all care of you. Okay, well... I'll let you know when I figure it out. I'm gonna hold you to that. Alex, can you make eye contact with me? I'm gonna tie this rope around your waist. The other end is tied around your brother. He'll use that stump as a fulcrum to feed rope your direction. Follow? So far. Awesome. You're doing super good. Remember, slow is steady. Steady's fast. Piece of cake. Piece of cake. Hang on, Ethan. I'm coming. You got this, Alex. Go back! You'll get hurt! I'm not going back without you. You're stuck with me till we're both safe. I have 
have to get him to chill out. <sighs> Ethan, I need you to calm down. Can you breathe for me? I should never have come out here! I was so stupid! Okay, hey, hey focus. Talk to me. You want to tell me how you got out here? I was trying to cross to the other side. Log fell. That's fine. That's okay. Let's talk about what comes next. Gabe's got us. We're not gonna fall. He's got the other end of the rope. No, I can't move if I move. You're not gonna fall, buddy. It doesn't matter. He's not making any sense. I need him to calm down. We can't stay here, Ethan. We have to- It'll see me! If I move, it'll see me! What's gonna see you? You don't understand. He's right. I don't. I can't help him if I don't understand what he's afraid of. And the only way to understand is to feel what he's feeling. Oh, fuck. I can't believe this is happening. Monster, I see it too. And I'm just as scared as you are. But Ethan, we're safe. You know why? It can't see me. Bangle of vanishing, just like Ninth Warden. I thought that was just a story. Well, some stories are true. Like monsters. So... You're gonna hold my hand, all right? As long as you're touching me, you're safe. Don't look down, okay? We'll be done before you know it. Do you think the log will break? 
I don't know. But if it does, I am gonna hold on to you so tight, okay? Okay. That's it. Come on. There you go. I got you. Damn, I'm picking all the popular choices. That, that kind of sucks, though, because, like, if all the po choices are, you know, really popular like this, I think that is not necessarily a good sign, but... Three percent of people have found the whiskey. Yeah, I am the forty-two percent that busted out the uh, the notebook to make sure I got the stuff right. Found my friends. They really, really is letting me down. But yeah, yeah. I think that's it for the night. Finished chapter one. I'm fucked up. Probably come back tomorrow, another day. We'll turn on chapter two. Thanks for watching.